Aaron, this is the second time in recent days we've been here to Cheshire High School, both times for vigils that were being held by community members to remember students that were whose lives were taken all too soon. Now, this latest vigil, as you had mentioned, was in remembrance of 19-year-old Chris Setembri. Uh, he was killed in what police are calling an apparent murder-suicide inside his home on Tuesday. Investigators believe his father, 49-year-old Christopher, shot his son while the teen was in a bedroom before then taking his own life. But at tonight's vigil, how Chris was killed was not the focus of tonight's vigil. It was about coming together, sharing memories, and supporting one another through the the passing of a student that many here call the friend. I just think it's great how everyone's coming together as one um, to be there for each other. Community members tell us that he was a member of the class of 2014. And as we'd mentioned earlier, this is the second time that we've been here in recent days. It was just last weekend students assembled for a vigil to remember 19 year old Isabella Gazzo. She passed away in a car accident that had taken place on uh, Route 9 South just by exit 21. And coming up tonight at 11 here on News 8, we'll tell you how community members here say they're working to get through two very difficult tragedies. For now, we're live in Cheshire. Josh Scheinblum, News 8.